Y'all wonder what I'm looking at. I'm waiting. <laughs> I'm just waiting on you guys to come on here. We're going to make some homemade cranberry sauce. I know a lot of you at work are at work. When you hop on here, just say hello. Let me know that you are here and I'm not alone. Although I might eat this cranberry sauce all by myself. <laughs> I got my, my light fixed. Can you tell? Of course, I've got to readjust it. There's a high and there's a low. Not sure where to go with that. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get started because I know a lot of you guys are on a lunch break or you're at work and you don't have time to sit on here um, on the internet and watch this crazy woman cook, especially when her crazy husband is not here to help her. He went to, he had a VA appointment in Charlotte this morning, so he's been there all morning, and I think he's on his way home, but he's not here yet, so I can't wait. I promise, 2 o'clock, and it's 2 o'clock, so here we go. So we're going to do cranberry sauce, which is something that everybody loves, well, I would say about 75% of the population probably has cranberry, uh, yeah, cranberry sauce on their kitchen table. Um, when they are eating Thanksgiving or Christmas meals. Some people like it year-round. Some people just like it during the holidays, which is great. I love it anytime. I so said it's my husband, but um, since I've been trying to eat right, I have not had a recipe for it, and um, we just recently got a recipe. So this is going to be really good. There's three of you on here. Hi, Sharon. Thank you for watching. Already shared it out. You go, girl. Sharon, I'm thanking you so much. If you put this in a group, if you share it in a group, I'll enter you into the uh, Christmas bundle. Just if you do share it into a group, type bundle and then say group. <laughs> so I'll know that you did. All right, so here we go. I'm going to go ahead and get started so I'm not going to have everybody waiting. There's more than one person on here. So here we go. All right, I'm going to give you some of the prelim preliminaries um, before I get started here, which is only going to take a minute. Um, because I want to make sure everybody knows. So we have an end of, month, end of the month drawing. Um, I don't know what day it is, but it's the last Saturday in this month. I'll do the end of the month drawing. Basically that is with everybody that has shared out my videos and I write y'all down. Everyone in the month of November that has shared out my videos is in a list already. But every time you share, I put your name in there again. And at the end, the last Saturday in November, I'll be drawing a name to receive an amazing gift and a thank you for sharing me out. Hi, Peggy. Hi, Peggy. Thank you. All right. Then we have the Christmas bundle. I wanted to bless you guys for Christmas. Y'all, this is going to be something that I would like to have. I'm not kidding. So to, to enter into the Christmas bundle, all you have to do is share, but you need to share it into a group. No, nope, you don't have to share it into a group, but let me tell you this. Share it out. Type bundle if you want to be uh, added to that instead of the regular, um, the regular, uh, you know, giveaway. Um, but if you want in my bundle, I don't know if I want to tell you yet now or not. Okay, so in that bundle, you're going to be receiving ingredients to make make things like you'll get some almond flour from me, a whole a brand new bag, a brand new bag of maybe brown swerve and white swerve. We'll see how that goes. Depends on how the availability of it, which is a sweetener for keto and low carb. Um, I'll be putting some spices in there for you. I'll be putting some kitchen tools in there for you so that you can cook in your kitchen and make something good. Hi, Edna. Thank you for sharing. Um, okay, so that is going to be in the Christmas bundle. Like I said, when you share it out, if you want in that bundle, say bundle. So I'll know that you want inside that gift because that one's coming out on the 12th of December. Wanted to get it into your hands before Christmas Day. All right, so the ones that share it into a group need to make sure I know you share it into a group. And here's why. Because whoever shares my lives into a group, uh, above everything I just told you, is also going to get ketones. <laughs> ketones. So you're going to get that too. That's $130 value, you guys. That's only going to come in the Christmas bundle if you let me know that you shared it into a group. And that's when you're going to get that. If you don't share it into a group but you want it in the bundle, that's fine. Just share it around with your friends or whatever. Just let me know you did it and type bundle in the comments so I'll know to put you in that, in that drawing. Okay, so that's amazing. So there's so many giveaways in this company, you guys. It's so good. So there's one more, just one more, and then I'm going to hop onto this recipe. Um, tomorrow is Friday 
And everyone who follows me knows that Fridays are, are Freebie Friday. Finally watching you live. Yes, you are, Patsy. Hi, Katrina. Uh, so tomorrow's Freebie Friday, which basically means, again, you have 10 people have the opportunity to win. I have boxes of it somewhere else, but this is a bag, which is very, not too many people have the bags. Um, you get a whole box of keto or bag. I'm not sure what they'll send for free, but they're going to send a whole a whole a whole box, $130 value to you for free. There are no obligations. You don't have to buy anything. You don't have to pay for shipping or handling. They do everything for you. That's tomorrow. So be sure that you check my, uh, my, my notifications probably between 12 and 3. Um, as soon as they post it, I will be posting it for you guys. So check it out. Um, if you, if you want to be entered into the freebie Friday, all you have to do first of all is make sure that you are in my group so if you're not in the group yet type group in the comments so I can make sure that you're in the group that way that when they post the uh, information for freebie Friday I can put you in there so you can get that information okay so that's what that's for so anyway inside that group there's things like recipes I wrote down there's recipes galore testimonials um, with pictures or just you know or pictures there's video testimonials, all kinds of testimonials in there um, uh, there's proof, there's scientific proof in there of eating low carb or keto, either one, videos, there's doctor's information in there, there's menus, there's food lists, there's children's menus in there as well, there's exercise, um, going on in there, live exercise, um, and not everyone in the group is eating keto. The ones that are not eating keto are taking this. <laughs> or one of the flavors they're taking the ketones and they are losing uh, body fat because of the the um, it gives you the energy that you need to do what you got to do to lose it also helps you not to crave it helps the sugar cravings if they're gone you don't overeat because you're not just not hungry um, I know these things I went off of it kind of sorta since I started doing the um, not not yeah since I started eating um, or started on my life insurance stuff because I just didn't have time to cook. I didn't have time to do anything. So we did a lot of fast stuff that is not good. <laughs> Patsy, I think that you're in the group, but I'll check to make sure, okay? Um, but anyway, so I didn't get, I haven't lost weight in a while. But I started back last week, and I've started going back down on the scale again. It's noticeable already in my pants, thank you, Lord. So um, even though I'm not 100% keto right now because I just don't have the time to be, I'm still losing because these ketones work. They put your body in a state of ketosis within 60 minutes of drinking them. So that's a great thing, no matter what you do. All right, so here we go with the recipe. Uh, if you haven't had enough time to get yourself a paper and a pen, be sure you get one. Of course, I will be posting the recipe. So first, this is basically a dump recipe. It's really easy. I'm gonna turn, uh, I'm gonna turn a cup of water, just one cup of water, and I'm going to put it in there over medium heat. I think it says medium. Medium heat. And to that, I'm just going to add all the ingredients. I'm going to add 12 ounces of fresh cranberries to the water. 12 ounces. My hands are clean. I washed them. I promise. <laughs> A cup of powder sweetener. I'm going to use the monk fruit powder sweetener. That's what I'm going to use. One cup of that. Hi, Mark. Thank you for watching, too. All right, so let's put that in there. I love cranberry sauce, so, so, so is my husband. I haven't had none in a while. <laughs> All right, so that's not quite a cup. So it's a cup of powder sweetener. Um, it's best to use the, um, that's about a cup. It's best to use uh, powder, but use keto or low carb if that's the way you're eating. And I'm sure if you're not eating keto or low carb, use regular powder sweetener. I don't see why it wouldn't work. Um, a cup of water, 12 ounces of fresh cranberries, a cup of the sweetener, one teaspoon of lemon jet, I mean orange zest. Oh my lord. I did this a while ago. I was like, I just want to eat the zest. That smells so good. So um, put a teaspoon of the lemon, I mean orange zest in there. And then you can add a, four, uh, a half a teaspoon of cinnamon. They said that's optional, but guess what? I'm going to put it in there just because. It says you can. <laughs> all right, and all you got to do now is just let it boil. Whoops. Okay, let it come to a boil. Stir it up really good. And when you start seeing, let me get my thing. I always do this. I always do this. Sorry, 
you guys. I can't find my... Excuse me. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> as soon as you see the cranberries starting to pop open, you can go ahead and mash them up. And uh, cook them for a little bit longer until they start to thicken, I reckon. And then you put them, put them up and let them cool down. I'm going to put them in a mason jar. <laughs> Oh my gosh, y'all. It's just now starting and I already smell this. It smells so good. Some of this lemon, this orange zest is not even, mm, it smells so good. It's not even crunched up yet. I'm working on it though. Let me see what this, if it's sweet enough for me. Oh my. This is going to be so good and amazing. Alright, so while I'm stirring this up and getting this to boil a little bit, you guys tell me what your plans are for Thanksgiving. Family? Y'all going to have family? I know there's a lot of craziness going on right now and everybody has their own opinion and I'm a very opinionated person. <laughs> you can ask people that that be, yes, she's opinionated, that's my husband. My opinion is we are family and I don't know if this new lockdown thing that they're wanting to do is, I don't know if it's nationwide, I don't know if it's statewide, I don't have a clue, but I will be celebrating with my family. They're my family. I love my family and uh, that's just the way it is. It's not like I'm asking a bunch of strangers to come in and if they want to come in, I just, you know, give them a mask if they want a mask and pray for them. <laughs> Because if anybody on here knows me, you know I believe in prayer. Let's see, Barbara. Me, my husband, and kids is all. Okay, so Barbara, you're having awesome. That would be amazing. We, um, some of our kids, are they're sc scattered out and abroad. They're everywhere. So we have um, only one of our daughters coming over with the kids. And we have our grandsons here um, that will be eating with us. This lemon zest doesn't want to break up. But they'll be eating with us too. Um, I think that might be it unless they bring friends. <laughs> if they do, they are more than welcome. And you guys, I don't know if Publix still has this. If you live in our area, Publix has it, or a couple of days ago, they might still have it since it's so close to Thanksgiving. They had a sale. Did y'all see that thing? <laughs> they had a sale on their turkeys. And I actually bought, it's an 18 pound turkey for a little over $5. A little over five, and that was at Publix. Um, so if you have a Publix in your area, it won't hurt to check it out. Uh, I think the limit is five to, is for two. So for $10, you know, if you have a larger family, it's gonna be there. That $10, you can actually go and get you two turkeys. It says, but whoever wants to come, Barbara, I'll be there. <laughs> I'll be there, Barbara. We've been wanting to meet anyway. I'll be there. Sorry, I can't be there. <laughs> but I know you're going to have a great time with your family. You guys, I love y'all so much. Y'all, it's starting to pop. Let's see what this thing says. The sauce will thicken as it cools. So I'm going to read these instructions to you. I can't get the lemon zest to break up. I will tell you that these things, when they start popping open, they pop like popcorn. And now you're, you and your husband, how sweet. For years, that's all me and my husband did, was just, just us two at Thanksgiving for the longest time. All right, so they're starting to break up and then I'm getting ready to smart smashing them. I had to switch my bowl around too, y'all. I thought that one cup of, uh, I thought that one cup of um, water in here with 12 ounces was going to be dry, but it's definitely not. Oh, thank you, Barbara. Thank you so much. Do y'all know that you guys, do y'all know that I spy you out? <laughs> I always go sometimes, well, not all the time because I don't have time lately, but spy y'all out on your Facebook, on your Facebook page to see, make sure y'all are okay. A lot of times I'll cross over your page and just pray for you. 
I think that God is raising uh, so many people up just to do nothing but pray right now. And prayer is one of the things that I know how to do. I just talk to God the way I should talk to God. Just be me. Be me. Speak his promises over you guys. I speak healing and prosperity and health in all of y'all's lives, um, including our own. All right, y'all. I don't know if y'all can see this. Can y'all see that? It's starting to thicken up. It's pretty. Sure does smell good. But I do know that I want this. There it is. I mean, going after the zest and couldn't catch it. Probably because. Here we go. I can tell you now it's the zest that's making this good. Mm. Alright, so it says right here. Uh, Mash berries until it, reach, it reaches its uh, desired chunkiness, uh, and then the sauce will cool. The sauce will thicken as it cools down. Um, Max, that's daddy, honey. Charles is here. <laughs> he's bringing. He's bringing food. Do not judge me. And I told you, right now while I'm doing tests, I'm getting ready. To, I mean, doing my life insurance stuff. I ain't got time to cook. So you brought fast food. Sorry, honey. Can you put it right over there? <laughs> I don't have a choice. I'll just have to drink my ketones. <laughs> you want to say hey, everybody? I'm getting ready to lock this down. Okay. Hey, everyone. <laughs> Should I pour this in there? Oh. No. Hey, everyone. Should I pour this in here? Charles, you'll be in trouble. You'll be in trouble. I'm in trouble. <laughs> hey, Lucy. Trouble hey, is his middle, his nickname. I bet y'all know that, don't you? <laughs> All right, I I'm told the person at the PA that. It is true. It is so true. All right, you guys, look, it's already started thickening. I'm going to go ahead and take it off the burner here. I'm going to put these bad boys in a, I think that jar might be too small. <laughs> might be a bigger jar. Barbara said hi, honey. Peggy said hi, Charles. All right, hi, hi. Go. <laughs> He's been going all morning. You know, when you go to the VA, you just be, be, better be ready because you don't know how long you'll be there. <laughs> I was trying to smush up this one. I can't get that one to even smush because I can't catch it. <laughs> I can't catch it. <laughs> Hi, James Tick. You just missed Charles. You just missed him. All right. That's it. So, if you are just now joining us and don't have all the information about how to enter into the end of month drawing, the Christmas bundle, or the uh, freebie Friday for tomorrow, Go back and listen to about the first 10 minutes or first five minutes of this video and it explains what to do, how to enter. I will tell you this, when you are entering for the Christmas bundle, uh, don't share the video out that says that we're gonna do it. Share the video out where I'm cooking. That's the one that you're gonna get be able to get entered with. Um, I'm not sure with the other stuff. It'll, it'll, I think it's kind of like maybe salesy, I don't know. But some of the groups don't like those. But if you're cooking, they allow they allow you to put those things into the to the groups. So anyway, you guys be blessed. Um, I'm going to enjoy this today. Oh my word! It says uh, I'm supposed to put this in a jar or a bowl or something, cover it up after it cools down a little bit, put it in the refrigerator for four hours, and it's ready to go. So anyway, it's going to be really good. Christy, hey Christy, bye you guys. Thanks for watching.